why you'll fail and why you must recommit, commit, and recommit. Hi, this is John Ruman. I work with The Real 007 of Sales Training Academy in the beautiful country of Trinidad and Tobago. I want to let you know that in sales, a very, very challenging industry for those of you who are in it, those of you who are brave enough to make the steps to go into it, nothing is more challenging than sales, but nothing is more rewarding than sales. And here's what happens. You're going to have goals. You're going to have objectives. You are not going to meet every goal and objective that you set out for yourself. But the important thing is you must realize for you to succeed in sales, you must understand and accept that failing, not meeting the numbers is something that you will do, but to get up again and understand that you must commit, recommit, and this must be a continual cycle for yourself. And here's another big challenge. When you hit the numbers, when the magic happens and you get the numbers and you can celebrate and the money's rolling in, there's a new cycle, a new quarter, a new month, new year, depending how your company does it. And you kind of need to start over in some respects. And hopefully you build a, a, a large funnel. You have a system going on. You have a series of contacts that you've built more and more relationships with. And you're doing better and better. But the challenge is the emotional roadblock you hit when you inevitably will fail. So... This is a short live, but an important one because you must understand that this is a critical factor because once you accept this and once you embrace it, the magic happens. Why is it so magical? Well, you're your own boss. You may work for a company, but you are the boss. In many companies, the highest, the greatest producing salesperson or salespersons make more money than the owner CEO. And what's crazy is they have more control over how much they actually make because they're the ones creating the relationships. They're the one that are actually creating the sales that bring in their more higher and higher income levels. So understand while it is scary to go out on your own, even if you're starting your own business, you have to be good at sales. But once you understand that your job is simply to set a target, achieve or not achieve, that's okay, and then recommit to something new. So when you don't hit it, all good, go again. Understand that this repetitive but empowering cycle will bring up more and more confidence as you, as you succeed, and it will make you feel more and more good within your overall general self-confidence, well-being, You'll become uh, hanging out with more people in your life. You'll naturally become more social. But again, the rewards are tremendous in sales, but you must embrace goals. You must understand that you will fail on a regular uh, timeline, but you must understand that you're going to fail. You're going to fail frequently and you're going to fail forward. So when you can fail in that manner, you're golden. So for those of you who are not in sales, find a way to get into it. It will blow up your mind in tremendous ways. And I don't care if your job is sales or not. If you own a company, you must be the best salesperson. And if you want to start a company, you must be an awesome person in sales. And you are selling all day. Sales is another term for trying to get a point across, for trying to convince someone. So even if you want your spouse to do X, Y, and Z, that is a sales technique. Is that understandable? So you're always in sales. Your children, if you have children, they sell to you all day long. Mommy, daddy, I want this. Thank you, not now. 10 minutes later, mommy, daddy, I want this. Not now. And then they break down your resistance. They understand the methodology. So if you are struggling with sales or if you want to improve your sales, me and Mr. Roger Moore, again, the real 007 of Trinidad, he and I are, are having a cold calling masterclass. If you're looking at this on, hey, good to see you guys. If you're looking at this on Facebook, you can see the actual time left. It starts in 11 days and 18 hours. It's on a Sunday, which 
we kind of uh, did surveys and it's like the best time for everyone. So Sunday, 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. So you can leave if you need to take transport before the light goes out. It is three hours. It is an intensive in that it is a simulation-based class. You will be practicing calls. You'll create a script so you'll know actually what to say. And then we'll teach you something called tonality. And tonality, hey, good to see you. Tonality is what you use to, what a radio announcer uses to actually have a sales process have. So if you imagine like when you kind of get quiet and then you get excited and, it, and there can be a sing song, a back and forth and, and pauses that may have a more dramatic effect on what you're trying to convey to the audience, that's tonality. So those are the two major points. We'll create a script, you'll create a script for your organization, for whatever you're selling or will sell, and then show you tonality, and then you'll practice it over and over and over again, and you'll get good. And the one of the most important things is to be confident on the phone. Once you become confident on the phone, you're golden. So the investment for the course is 600 TT, and you can have you can pay that half and then the balance in the class so you can just pay it all one time um, should you want to do the full six week cycle which starts on the 13th of september which that is class three off the top of my head um, of there's six mod six module module three is the call one that we're doing on the 15th of july should you want to do that one we will credit 400 of 600 towards the class so and that class is 3000 tt so well worth it but please send me a message if you're on instagram send me a message or if you're on facebook send me a message let me know what questions you have i'll be happy to answer them in any way i can and help you to understand and feel the importance of the commitment and recommitment take this in your life so i do this a lot in coaching by the way is and it's one of the reasons people hire me is it's important to have commitment and I'm doing this and then when you don't do it that's okay what happened recommit and the more you continue that cycle and you begin to feel your inner power and the true possibility of what you have magic happens so thank you for your time have an incredible night shoot me a message hey Clark shoot me a message I think that's Thomas Clark how you doing Thomas so shoot me a message. I'd be happy to help you with anything. Have a great rest of your night. Take